Every year, Roy has a live in concert DVD out for Christmas. This year's is called King Thong, and he's busy promoting it, tonight with a phone interview on Capital Gold. But out on mainstream media, it's a rocky ride for Roy. He wants to talk about his DVD, but they want to confront him about his act. Live radio. But it must seem to you now that really you can't say anything without upsetting people. Somebody was asking me, or oh, well, was it not long ago I was being interviewed for a magazine, a, a woman's magazine, and this lady was, all she was talking about was racialism, sexism and feminism and all this, that and the other. And she was really getting on my tits. And as she went on and on and on about the rights and wrongs, I said, if I wanted to put the world's rights at wrongs, I would have become a politician. But I left school with with uh, with no all levels or anything like that. When I left school, I was as thick as two short planks. I don't I mind admitting it. I've had a topsy-turvy life, and I've made some. It's more remarkable now that I've made a little bit of something of myself. Are there any limits? Is there anything you won't talk about? I don't talk about um, abusing children and things like that. I'll hit on the subject by mentioning people that's in the news, like Gary Glitter and Michael Jackson. But personally, uh, it's not the kind of subject I talk about. I don't do very many religious gags because I don't know any funny ones and I, I don't I don't bend my mind that way. Does it not bother you that people think you're just some thick thug that goes around doing the most outrageous humour and offending people? Because you're not like that. A lot of people can't, you know, they just can't see the man and then see the act. It's two different people. So you call me schizophrenic if you want. I'm not bothered. <sighs> that was hard work, wasn't it? How'd it go? All right. Sometimes he asks you questions, you know, and you've, uh, you haven't thought of an answer to him. It's like a question on a question. He said, if I get too personal, you can always tell me the, the f that. I said, I can't tell you that on live radio, can I? This is Roy Jimmy Brown listening to the Alex Belfield show. Yes. Who the f is the f Who the f uh, who lives next door to Alice? It's Alex Belfield. Well, tittle my f***.